Wait, wait, T minus 15 seconds. 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 0. And liftoff of the Atlas V. Launching the first interplanetary mission from the West Coast. And NASA's InSight, the first outer space robotic explorer to study the interior of Mars. Continues to look good at this point in the mission. Objective pressures, pump speeds, expected regions, extra ratio, controlling within expected parameters. The RD 180 engine providing 860,000 pounds of thrust. Physical body rates continue to look good. All booster systems look nominal at this point. Mach 1. The rocket is now traveling faster than the speed of sound. Coming up, max the rocket Q. will enter max Q. This is the point where mechanical stress in the rocket reaches its peak because of the rocket's velocity and resistance created by Earth's atmosphere. Coming up on the throttle down. Extra has throttled back right on schedule. Signatures look good. Pump speeds, injector pressures continue to look right within band. Body rates controlling down the middle. Current altitude is 13 miles. Downrange distance 7 miles. Current velocity 1,965 miles per hour. Closed loop guidance has begun. The first part of the flight was pre-programmed trajectory. Now the rocket is giving itself feedback on its flight path. And Q alpha steering has begun. Body rates look good. Pump speeds, injector pressures, all within band. RCS pyro valve has been fired. System is now pressurizing flight level. Signatures look good. Current altitude is 30 miles. Downrange distance, 43 miles. Current velocity, 4,542 miles per hour. You are looking at a live view from the Atlas V rocket. The RD-180 engine continues to burn. Flight rates continue to look good. RD-180 still performing well. View off the steering has been completed. Booster is now one quarter of its liftoff weight. Currently flying at four G's acceleration. Loose phase cooldown has begun. Pogo pyro valve has been fired. Moving the throttle to five G's. We are three minutes fifty seconds into flight, and we're nearing booster engine cutoff or BECO. Back to four point six G's in preparation for BECO. Boost phase cooldown has completed. And we have BECO. Shutdown looks good. And the RD one eight one eighty engine on the first stage of the Atlas V has shut down. Stage separation. We have box and fuel pre start, the G and two purge firing, the RCS is underway. We have ignition and full thrust on the RL-10. And the second stage, nope, stage engine, the RL-10, has ignited. And we have indication of payload fairing jettison. Looks like a good step. And the payload fairing that was encapsulating the InSight spacecraft has been jettisoned.
the RL-10C engine, the second stage of the Centaur, continues to burn. And You're looking at live animation and telemetry look very good. of the Centaur second stage on its flight path. Our GN2 purge firings underway for thermal conditioning. Pump As you can see to the bottom right of your screen, the flight path of the rocket. Charge. All have been banned for the set MR.